Hello and welcome to another episode of Farming Simulator 22 on Somerset Farms. We are still obviously in April. I'm just kind of just running around making sure everything's kind of where it should be. We've got not much we can do today. Um, right, so I say today. I meant like right now. Um, right, so this means that our, our job today is going to be getting this grass field done. Obviously, we... I've never used this mower before. Oh, that's loud. I love how my steering wheel has gone off the second I jumped in this vehicle. Does anybody use a Logitech steering wheel and have so many problems like I do? One sec, I just need to tab out. Right, I'm back. I've got to remember now to edit that tab out. <laughs> First you need to lower the tool. I did. No, I didn't. I thought I did. Wow, this tool is super. Mow it. What is going on here? Okay, I... That doesn't work when I do it. <laughs> ah, I've never used this. There we go. We have to turn on both sections of the two wall. Right, there we go. Um, yeah, I've never used this thing in my life, so kind of trying to figure that out. I didn't realise I had to turn the back bit on as well. I go, I want to go first person desperately to see the view, but I think it's going to be so loud. I'm literally having to turn my headset down, so I'm not really sure what the sound's going to be like here. I do apologise if it's like massively bad. Oh, I, I want to go first person just to do this next strip. Oh, I love it. Oh, that is ace. That is freaking awesome. Yeah. This should hold about 5,000 litres. I've got no idea how much we're going to get off this, but considering I've only done technically one headland, and I'm at 3,500. Okay, we're going to get loads of grass off this. Yeah, I, I need to get into May, but we can't go into May till we've at least cut this grass once. Um, it definitely needed doing today. Well, that's pretty cool in first person. I like that. This is a nah, I like this mod. This is cool. Right, if I just go third person again, because I can re try and get it done a little bit quicker. Although saying that, I have now just run out of space. This is what happens, you see, when you actually plant proper grass. We get... I thought it had a 5,000 litre capacity. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> Is it 5,500? I could have sworn it was only a 5,000 litre capacity. Um. Oh, don't tell me I've broken my... Uh just try and get that picked back up. Don't tell me I've uh, I've broken my uh, my sheep pen. I've got a habit of uh, accidentally breaking things. I'm not gonna lie. Right, so 
that's not actually working the trigger right. It might not take loose grass. Right, here's the easiest way to find out. If it takes a bale, I'm going to be fuming. Um, I'll have to take the big bale spike. I don't have just a little bale spike. Also though, I've just realised I don't have a... What is it either, do I? I don't think it takes hay. I think it just takes grass. Um, some 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 sheep pens will take hay. Um, some literally just take grass. So yeah, there's only one way to find out. Either way, worst case scenario, we'll cut the grass. We'll make a massive pile. We'll just take the baler up. I bought that mower now, so we're going to use that mower. This is going to take me a quick second to get up there. Yeah, it's not working the, uh, the tipping point. It's weird, actually. Yeah, I, I really like this telehandler except the speed of this telehandler it is so freaking slow do need to maybe get like a little uh, skid steer or something put that maybe up here nice just to have something up here yeah if this doesn't take the thing I'll have a quick look at the, uh, the giant file uh, on the giant head here. I've clearly just accidentally uh, removed something I shouldn't have done. What it is, is because I make so many changes to the map, sometimes I, I'm i not really paying attention and I accidentally do something I shouldn't do. It's easy enough to add back in if it is what I think it is. Basically, it's just the unloading section. But yeah, I'm not even sure if this will actually works, I don't even know if this is going to cure the problem. That's the thing. But it may only take grass. I can't see in here. Nope, it did take it, did you see? Um, animals, sheep. So it doesn't take loose, it doesn't take loose stuff. That sucks. That, that actually really does suck, like, a lot. Um, it's not the end of the world right now. It will take bills by the time I'm finished. Uh, it will take loose grass by the time I'm finished. I didn't realise it didn't take loose material. Or at least from this anyway. Yeah, I didn't realise that. Yeah, by the look of it, it just doesn't take the loose grass. Took the bale. Right. That is fine. We'll just make some piles of grass. We'll bring the bale up. And we'll uh, get that sorted. Yeah, I wasn't sure. But yeah, we will make it take grass, just loose grass by the time we're uh, by the time we're done. It's no good at only taking bales. No good at all at only taking bales. Deep learning experience today guys you've all learned something about this map like I said this this is like one of the things for example that I change about the default you know like try to just make it better like I say the map has bit the back and the, the back the map is basically a great base to build off of um, that's for sure
Um, yep, yeah, it was 5,500. We might as well cut it all the way down to there. It's a lot of grass. <laughs> a lot of grass came out of this. I'm not going to lie. That, was, that caught me out. <laughs> Loads of grass is coming. That, that pile is way bigger than it should be. I'm telling you. <sighs> Can we please turn? Oh my god, this, this mower is beginning to be a nightmare. You need to unfold the mower first. I did. Jesus Christ, I do keep unfolding. Yeah, it's very complicated, this thing. Why can't we just turn it on and it automatically just do what we need it to do? Either way, we've got 15,000 litres of grass. Remember though, guys, that is just from this field. Just this field, where before we did all the edges of the field and we only got 23,000. And we went round all the field edges, up in, you know, from this northern bit. Excuse me on that. Oh. That actually gave me the grass from that. Right, there we go, we'll do that. Lovely. We'll need to get the roller up here at some point because it needs. Um, I think we need to buy a grass roller. I don't think we own one. I don't think the roller we've got works grass. Sorry about the uh, quick moving on the mouse, guys. I'm just trying to just be able to see this. 50% again. like loads of grass from this field but if we were to cut this grass like say every three or four months for example there is enough grass now in this field to feed these animals um, that's that is absolutely for sure this way around here just gonna go here like I say, we'll bring the baler up. I'm not messing around, we'll just bring the baler up. I can't believe it's, uh, it's done it to me, to be honest. Yeah, we, we can soon give it some, uh, some loose grass. It's not the end of the world. We've just got to change the uh, XML file, which means there'll be another update for... Uh, for my updated version of this map. grass off the edge of the fields well not the edge of the field but you know like around these trees and stuff just to try and make another 5,000 litres it would be nice we didn't quite make 15 16,000 I spent like an hour doing this though last time like I said this is just kind of preparing the sheep for summer
marker S there. Don't have to, we don't have to get it all. I say it was kind of a learning experience um, doing this today. I can't believe it doesn't take a bill to be honest. I'm, I'm really disappointed in that. Uh, it doesn't take loose grass, sorry. It only takes bales. That's what I meant to say. Like I say, it's not exactly the end of the world. It's it's a line of code. And we just kind of have to be like, yep, yeah, we'll just do that. But I feel like it's more a case of you shouldn't have to do it. I love that though. Right, let us uh, let us get that turned off there. We need to bring the uh, the mower up now. Uh, the baler up now. Um, I tell you what, that one will do. It's got the bigger tyres on right now. Yeah, I, I did not expect I'd have to do anything like that today. Kind of feel a little bit like wow. Thought of just giving it loose, uh, loose grass would have worked. Now, the only other option I've got now is I can either edit the XML code and give it loose grass, not a problem whatsoever, or we can basically just um, buy a really cheap 10 grand tractor, not just with a mower and then a windrower, you know what I mean, and then a tiny little baler. I'm not talking like a big square bale like this one, like one of the tiny round ones. Yeah, I'm not going to get as much done in this episode now as I planned because I didn't realise I was going to have to mess around so much with the uh, cheap feeding. be done right let us get this here and turn that on and let's just go full pelt it's gonna be really really quick guys there's not you know there's nothing we can do about that it's just the way it's going to be but we've managed to get one and a half builds already Yeah, this isn't exactly how I uh, plan to do this today. I plan to just drop off the loose bale. Uh, the loose grass, sorry, not bale, because I'm looking at bales. Yeah, that was not what I was planning on doing today. Now, technically, I could do a bit more grass, but I feel like... I feel like we've just been really delayed as it is. No, we're just gonna... We're just gonna do that just to uh, just to get it done. All right, get that in there. All right, that should be the sheep done for the rest of the. Oh wow, forty-three thousand. Yeah, them sheep are done for the rest of the year. Fantastic. Uh, the only thing we've got to do now is the sheep area will technically be on a little bit less fertilizing. So uh, yeah, we can soon do that. We'll uh Don't think I've got follow me mod installed. I do not. Alright, so I'd have to drive these back separately. That's fine. Yeah, that's it. I had such plans I wanted to do today, and now the plans have just completely gone out of the window because of the uh, 
because they've been attacking grass. Ugh. Ever stayed. But yeah, that was kind of what I wanted to do in April. Other than that, I was going to cut the cow field and I was going to cut field 35 just because. Well, just because, really. But we're still looming and hiring about maybe bringing in the um, cow pen into field 35. I'm still thinking of doing that. I'm thinking of maybe moving the, the meat cows over to that field. Um, for me, personally, it's more just... Yeah, and we can feed the meat cows just grass. We can literally feed them grass. Which means that mower would have a better use again. Um, finances at the moment is the reason we're not doing that. Right, need to get that machine brought back down. Yeah, not uh, not going to get as much done this episode. I really didn't expect that to be such a problem. Yeah, we definitely need a little Bob's, uh, little skids here, Bob Cat or something like that. Tell you what, actually, you never know. There might actually be one in the store in the afternoon. Now, no, we just got the cars still. Yeah, that mo there's nothing wrong with that one. I could have sworn I used that grass, that little green grass mower, you know. I could have sworn I used that grass mower last time and just poured it straight in, thousand at a time. I'm, I'm sure I did. So why didn't it... Oh, hang on a minute. Right, I might have just figured out why it didn't work for us. I might have just figured out why it didn't work for us. Oh, come on. This thing's sucking forever. Need to have a look at the um, TMR as well. Make sure we've got plenty of that because that's quite an expensive machine to rent. Um, obviously, we'll make up as much as we possibly can, like we did last time. We've managed to feed the cows for a year from one rental. But obviously, we've now got one less um, hay bale because we've. Uh, Accidentally put a hay bale in the sheep. Well, I say accidentally. We didn't accidentally do anything. But um, cow. Oh, they've still got thirty-five. Yeah, I, I, I just need a second, guys. I just need a second. Um, it doesn't really matter if we fill this machine up again because it'll, it'll go ready for the next time. I just want to test something since it didn't work for us um, but if you notice now in the top left hand corner you see like we're on the mower section yeah we might need to be on the bag section that might be what the problem is I don't want to have to get rid of this for that little green one I will get that little green one again but if I do I will edit the XML just to make it a bit bigger because it was a little bit small but it wasn't it was more realistic but the reason why I got this was just to, so this job didn't take well this long um, so if I do that and I do that and I stay on the one above are you going No, it will not empty from this machine. It's definitely something to do with this machine. Like I say, it's not the end of the world, we've got grass in there. 
Yeah, I was just wondering if that was going to be the problem. Yeah. That green one definitely worked. I'll get the green one again off, off camera and test it, because if the green one does work, then... Uh, we'll just go and buy the green one again. I was just trying to save a bit of time. Trying to save a bit of time and then ended up actually costing me more. That, that took a lot longer to do because, well, no bills. Yeah, a bit gutted about that. Yeah, we'll just we'll just buy a really small mower, uh, a really a really small so uh, sorry cheap cheap tractor. We'll just cut it and bale it. I'm not gonna mess around like that. I can get ten grand back for that uh, for that mower. Yeah, just a little bit suspicious on why it's just not not working properly. I was going to roll it, but I'm going to just fertilise it now. We've wasted way too much time feeding these uh, feeding these sheep there. By the look of it, that is all we're going to have time for as well in this episode. That is... Ugh, yeah. I got next to nothing done that I wanted to. Literally next to nothing. Kind of gutted about that. Yeah, we'll uh, we'll drop this down and I'm gutted. I kind of wanted to get into May today and get a little bit more done. Like I say, saying that I could. Let, let's have a look at tractors. End of each episode. I do like to see what could possibly come up to buy and what we could do. Now I do have a tractor mod. Now I, I did technically add it to this series, but it was more just because I just. I was testing it in Somerset maps and I was like, oh, and I was uh, adding another mod to this series. Um, so, yeah, I've kind of added a few mods. Not all for this series, it's just, I, you know, I've got another Somerset one, you see, where I, I test mods. Um, yeah, guys, let me show you what I'm thinking here, guys. Look at this, right? There is a mod going to hopefully be coming to Mod Hub soon. It is my mod. I can't buy it because it's under, mine's under. This farmer's market, guys, is absolutely awesome. It literally, ignore what it says on the left-hand side about cotton, things like that. It basically sell, It basically buys everything. But it's on a default building. So yeah, hopefully um, that gets passed. Had a few issues with the coding because you know I've been dyslexic. It was not the best. Uh, yeah, the other thing, guys, is I, I'm thinking, and I wouldn't mind some input um, for our series. Not, not, I'm not going to add it to the map in general, but for us, I'm thinking of maybe buying and bringing this building in. Um, it basically just makes straw thing things with straw. And we've always got loads of extra straw. Now, I know I said I didn't really want to do productions on this series. That is kind of the case still. I just... We end up with a lot of straw, and straw's not really worth out. And I just thought, if we can dump a bit of straw in, like, this building here, we, uh... You know, we, we might just... How could we do it? We could do it. Right, we need to be on the uh, right, we need to be on three sides. Yeah, look, one there, water in there, straw in the back, turning it on back there. So that would have to be done in three sections. Oh. Yeah, like I said, I'm just thinking about maybe doing that. Yeah. Um 
Yeah, what was the other thing I was going to look at? Oh, yeah, tractors. Um, see, I've added this. This is going into Attingham Park, basically. That's kind of why it's... Um, I put it in, but I was, I was just been driving it about and testing it on certain little things. Um, yeah, absolutely. Yeah, oh, little three-point, little front loader. There we go. Little, little ten thousand, well, thirteen and a half thousand pound uh, little tractor for Attingham for running around the uh, the yard. Eighty-one brake horsepower. Right, let's have a look. If we buy a new baler for doing the grass work, um, we would be looking at something along these lines. Forty, oh look, forty-five brake horsepower. So that means forty-five. Let's have a look. What have we got? Um, I'm trying to think of something we can use like this. You know. One of these new little mod ones come part of a DLC pack. You know, something, something daft like that. 98 brake horsepower. It's not the quickest thing. It is absolute... Oh, no. No front linkage. We would need a front linkage. Um, yeah, we're getting a little bit expensive here, aren't we? Sixty-eight brake horsepower. So we could go around and mow with that, and then we could go around with the windrow. So yeah, maybe, maybe something like that. Maybe like the little electric thing. Um, what we got here? Hundred. Ooh, that kind of boosts the price up way too much. Um, I think we've got that on. Yeah, we've got that on our live stream series. I don't want that thing. Um, 85. We used that on Calmland, but it was pretty good. I'm just looking for wide tyres if it's an option. I'm going to presume that it's not an option. Ah, white tyres there. So, £17,500. £17,500. We can get this little baler here for 30 So, we're talking £50,000. We do already technically have a little front mower. Um, but, I don't think... Which front mower do we have already? You have to forgive me, I can't see anything. Uh, 3.2... You see that that's quite high. So we'll probably buy another front mower because we'd want something with a lot less brake horsepower, like that one there, twelve grand, forty brake horsepower. So what we're looking at, forty brake horsepower. So forty. We're looking at eighty-five brake horsepower to run, to run that machine, that kind of machinery. Eighty-five. Um. So that would run it. That would run it. That would run. No, that won't run it. It's not a tractor duh. Um we've never used that 85 it's just on the boundary though. Nope. No. Nope. Um Saying that actually, we use the eight the seventy eight ten Ford and Nottingham. We could maybe use the um 7610. Maybe we do that. Maybe we do that. Look, 105 brake horsepower. We can put a front we can put a front thatcher on it. So it can do the bail work as well. Put some extra lights on. Yeah, I tell you what, yeah, we might look at something like that. I say I like driving the little Fords. I think they're really nice, and we're not actually using that one in Attingham. We're using the uh, the other one. Right, I'm just going to see if there's anything quickly we can get done in this episode. I was hoping there was maybe going to be some mowers come in in the shop. We need some wider mowers, but we don't really have enough money in the bank. 
We're into April. We're into 3 p.m. in April. We are kind of uh, getting on in a day. I, I kind of just want to get into May, but I don't want to waste what's left of April. This will be big weed soon, so we'll have to just big weed them up. Um, what have we got in here now? Uh, 8,600. What have we got? Slurry. Yeah. No. We've got nothing else we can get done right now. I don't want to be cutting the grass with the... With the little... With that thing again. Oh no, guys. I am going to leave it here. I know we can just been... Talk about what we could do in the next episode and tractor wise. I need to see if I can figure out if I can make that mower sell the grass. That, that's the issue. If I can figure that out, then you know, then we can uh, we can carry on with that. But until next time, guys, I do massively appreciate everybody for watching. I do apologise if it's a bit of a oh you didn't get much done today. Yeah, you're right. We didn't. It was kind of just grass work. Um, there's not much we can get done in may either that's the next issue but july is coming july is coming and then we can uh, crack on we'll get some grass we'll get some more grass work done we'll get some more we'll get some in silage we need some hay ready for the tmr so we've got a busy couple of months coming up with quite a bit of grass work um so yeah if we have shorter episodes but grass work you know no one can be like oh you're not you know you're not just spending like three hours doing grass work i'm just looking around making sure we've got no else to do which we've done everything is done and dusted so yeah guys i do massively appreciate everybody watching the episode i hope you have enjoyed it and until next time i will see you all later on bye for now